We'll be watching the sector. Thank you for your help, mercenary.
The Deadwalker Sentinels are no longer a problem, for now. It's a start, but the main door is still out of reach. But now we're free to approach the city and look for another way in. Until the guard changes, or until they realize they haven't heard from them for a while and stronger patrols come down on us like a ton of bricks. The die is cast. We have to go fast and be ready to fight to get our city back. If there is a way in, you can bet the Deadwalkers have secured it. Those abominations are everywhere. Not necessarily. They're pretty careless when they don't have a general behind them telling them what to do. Victory will have softened them up a bit. As long as nobody raises the alarm, we should be able to count on that. Let's hope so. And while we're on this subject, there's something else you can do for us. Ask away. The Deadwalkers still control the main road. One of the towers you took is near one of their barricades. When the undead notice they've lost contact with their sentinels, that tower will be the first on their list of places to visit, and it won't hold out for long. The soldiers I posted there will do their duty to the end, but if we could eliminate the barricade to gain as much time as possible, it would be a lot better for us. Save your spit. The barricade's no longer a problem. It was in my way, too. Really? Excellent. Now we can keep watch everywhere on the steps. I'll be going now.
I've seen everything. The dead walkers kicking each other's asses. I beg your pardon? What? This one talks. What the hell are you, a lich? A zombie scribe? We've only known one another a few seconds, and already you insult me. Charming, I must say. If you aren't one of them, then what are you? I am an immortal, superior spirit. And you? So you're an ice lord. I thought you'd be... taller, or something. I have absolutely no involvement with that bunch of cheapskate conjurers, and I would never humiliate myself by working for them, since that's what you seem to be suggesting. Yeah? Rotting flesh sticking out bones? You sure as hell look like a damn dead walker to me. Tut tut. Did no one ever tell you not to judge a book by its cover? It's true that you're young, but use your wits. Would I be fighting my own troops if what you suggest were the truth? All I can be sure of is that you're not really alive. And that makes you my enemy. And what's more, you're in my way. body will not survive more punishment. In all my 6,000 years, I have never witnessed such power. You seem to be as unique a being as I am. What is the source of your power? What are you? There's a demon inside me, a creature of flame that claims to come from the world heart. How fascinating. Even if the term demon seems to lack precision, nonetheless, I must confess that in spite of my vast knowledge, I have no idea what this entity really is. At last, something interesting. I was almost dying of boredom. I suspect that exploring what's inside you will probably be quite exciting. No, don't speak. I'm coming with you. I can't wait to find out more about your case. I can't have you tagging along with me right now. I have something to do in the city. Wait for me back at the camp. We'll talk about what we think you and I are later on. Yes, I've seen where your camp is. Actually, it's quite surprising the dead walkers haven't noticed it yet. However, I suspect my unannounced arrival might pose a slight problem for your brothers in arms. Yeah, I guess with your face, they might not welcome you with open arms. Just tell them I sent you, and try to behave. Very well. Do you know your way into the city? There's a hidden entrance not far from here. I'll show you where it is on your map. Thanks. <laughs> 